In this tutorial, we're going to be creating crop tool presets in Photoshop that will allow us to quickly crop our images to 10 inches on the long side at 200 dpi. This is an industry standard size for both photo agencies and news outlets around the country. So with Photoshop running, we don't even have to have an image open to do this. The first thing we want to do is select the crop tool. So we can push the letter C on our keyboard for the keyboard shortcut, or we can click on the crop tool icon in the toolbar manually to bring up the tool. And then the next thing we're going to do is go up to the options for the crop tool. Now depending on what crop tool you used last, this may be different. But what we want to do is click on the drop down arrow. And we want to select the width, height, and resolution. The W, X, H, X, and resolution. The width is first, so that's the one on the left. The next box over is the height. And the last box is where you'll put the DPI in. So we're going to create a horizontal crop tool first. That'll make it... a if it's a horizontal image, the long side will be 10 inches long. So we're going to type 10 into that space and put an I in so that it uses inches instead of pixels. We're going to leave the second box blank. We don't want it to constrain the image. So if I put a like 6 in there, then all the images will be 6 by 10. This way you can change the crop but still have it be 10 inches long. We're going to skip that second box, like I said, and we're going to type 200 into the pixels per score inch box. We're going to go back to where the width, height, and resolution uh, option is. Click on that. Scroll down to new crop preset. And you can change this name to whatever you want so that it's easy to remember. For me, I use news photo because most of my images are horizontal and I need them to be 10 inches on the long and 200 dpi when I send them into publication. So type whatever you want for this. Hit OK. And if you go and look up here, you'll now have that as your crop preset. To make a vertical one, all we have to do is go back up to the options. And in between the two boxes for width and height, there are two arrows. If we click on the little two arrows, it's going to make it now 10 inches tall for your vertical images. And we'll do the same thing. We'll click on the drop down arrow, go to new crop tool preset, and you can call this vertical news photo, news vert, whatever you want to call it, and hit OK. And now both of those crop tool presets will be available for you anytime you need to crop an image.